Are you ready? <laughs> You're ready? You're full on. Yeah, I'm Can you see ready. out of it? Uh, heck no. A little, okay. a little more. Okay. okay. Now kick it hard straight. <laughs> <laughs> You're close. Yay! Yay. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, now go straight. All right. All right, you got the one. I'm ready. The Girl Scouts movement is this great intergenerational sisterhood. This summer, we have our annual Girl Scouts Love the Outdoors Challenge. It's an incredible opportunity for our girls to spend time outdoors and explore the natural world. We're thrilled to have the partnership of Hydroflask this year as our sponsor for the Outdoor Challenge. The Girl Scouts Love the Outdoors Challenge is a great way for our Girl Scouts to have an awesome introduction into their summer experiences. It's 50 unique challenges that can really be modified to serve every age level of Girl Scouts. <laughs> They're devised to get you to realize that being outdoors and loving it and making connections starts with some simple activities and builds from there. Do you want to use these yeah, starting like points? Ball. Wait, we could attach this to like that little deck and like try to like do a basketball? Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay. We put together a little obstacle course that showcases a bunch of different athletic abilities and also focuses on teamwork and just like supporting each other. Throughout the entire course, we're going to be cheering each other on, supporting each other, making sure that everyone like just has a fun time. Girl Scouts inspired me to be like courageous and strong. Just getting a chance to get active, be happy and healthy, I would say. Our mission is to build girls of courage, confidence, and character who make the world a better place. Our challenge is uh, to clean up a park, and usually you would think, oh, that would be trash, but also we have invasive species here, and those knock the ecosystem out of balance. On this plant, you can see that the stem is kind of fuzzy, and then also the way that the leaves like stick out in different directions. Nice. Girl Scouts definitely teaches me how to be a stronger woman and build confidence to try new things. It gives me so many opportunities that I never thought that I would have the chance to experience. There you go. Is that, I think that's the whole room. I think that the Girl Scouts Love the Outdoors Challenge is really a, a great opportunity for Girl Scouts to select those things that they're really interested in and care about and have a kind of guided way to get into the outdoors. I just love to I've been doing courtship. It's like One thing that's really cool about photography and videography is you can find beauty in the everyday little things, whether it's hiding underneath clovers or the clover itself, or bark on a tree, or um, preferably some banana slugs. Oh, wait, there's something. There's something. There's something. There's something. There's something. Did you guys find something? Girl Scouts is a huge part of what made me who I am. It gave me the confidence to say, I am a filmmaker, I am pursuing film, and I did make a feature film. All my fellow Girl Scouts are capable of fantastically great things, and Girl Scouts gave that to me, um, and I'm so grateful for that. This experience of finding your way through the Girl Scouts, every generation has its challenges, and the rising generation of girls today is no different. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> <laughs> Painting, and I think it brings us back to like our roots and reconnects us with who we are. Mm -hmm. I could be looking at a cloud and someone else on the other side of me or next to me can see that cloud differently. And I think that's how I see the world and how I see different conversations too, is someone else can have a totally different perspective and I'm not gonna get angry at them for not seeing it my way. For me, my favorite thing to do is just to disconnect from everything else except for myself. So I always like bring earbuds and I listen to music. Um, yoga, I did a lot of. I got really into that after um, I got sick. I got um, diagnosed with like a life-threatening medical condition. So I was like in the hospital for months and um, it used to be like my favorite thing. Oh my God, I don't wanna cry. <laughs> Please, um, this is a safe space. It was like my favorite place to just be able to go outside and get out of like a hospital because that's like, that's all I knew for so long of like having an IV in my arm or getting my blood drawn and like coming outside and just like 
you know, you take that for granted, I think, a lot. Just like, you don't realize that some people, like, they don't get to go outside as often because they can have compromised immune systems. And I think, like, coming outside is almost like a treat now. Like, yeah. it's something we look forward to. The outdoors can bring so many girls together. We've come from, like, all different parts, and now mm -hmm. we're all just, like, in this one small bubble in the middle of Pescadero. I yeah. even feel like we all have been, like, friends for, like, years. And yeah. It's <laughs> kind of weird. <laughs> no service, but we're also <laughs> yeah. No <laughs> service. <laughs> I feel like we're getting to know each other so well. Yeah. I know. I know. And then just the rest of the world. <laughs> I don't think I've ever put myself out there as much as I have in this entire thing because I'm usually very introverted and I feel I have talked to probably every single person here <laughs> and that made me very happy. Like I think that one of you guys are going to end up in the White House one day <laughs> and you guys are going to be the reason that this country ch changes for the better. Whenever I meet a Girl Scout I just know I'm meeting a future leader and I just am so honored to be a part of that. Let's go. You lead, I'll follow. There's nowhere we can wander. I know you hear it.